Good morning, everyone. How are you all? It's Saturday the 8th of May. It's Paris here from Mount Eliza. Sorry if I look a bit bedroom eyes. I've been up a bit early again, doing my work as I normally do. And I just want to say good morning to everyone, wishing you a fabulous Saturday morning. No matter where you are in the world, if it's a Friday night. So I'll just uh, get Laurie to say good morning to you. She's having a break. I've brought her over to have a break in. Now, Laurie, what are you doing there? So Laurie's having her water, that had her aloe vera. And I'll just turn you around here. And her powder with the green stuff in there is organic spirulina, which has great um, uh, zinc and iron, and, um, iron uh, properties. Right, all birds need all their vitamins, just like we did. Good girl, Laurie, good girl. You okay, Laurie? Laurie, you're looking a bit skinny. I hope you're eating all your food. I'll give you some more apples today. So good morning, Michelle, good morning. So um, let's have a look who else we have here. F friends, sorry about the kitchen, but um, I don't live in a display home. I've got parents to look after. Hi, Jada. Jada, good morning. Are you okay? You're scratching yourself. Good morning. Good girl. So good morning to everyone, Jada. Good morning. Now, Jada, you've got two platters here just for you. Good morning. Good morning. Good girl. She wants to, she wants to massage, friends. Hang on. I'm trying to use the phone and... Good girl, good girl. Good girl, Agapi. Oh, you want to massage everywhere. She wants behind the ears there. And the other side. All right, okay. I've got to be careful I don't scratch you with my nails. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. And this is Kevin. Kevin's having his brekkie. Good morning, Kevin. Good morning. Oh, he's scared of the phone, Kevin. So he's got his uh, little cover there. And his food and his, um, that's all right, that's okay, I won't go too close to him. So friends, I just want to wish you a fabulous day today. Make sure you have your vitamins this morning. Even if you're going to have, even if you're going to have, hello Carmel, even if you're going to have your coffee like naughty Philip is. You say good morning to everyone, Philip. Good morning everyone. Yeah, even if you're going to have that, what you're going to do is, is you're going to take out your vitamins. It can be celery stalks, it can be celery juice. Or it can even be the wild blueberries that I've been talking about, that I've learned about from medical medium Anthony William. And I'll show you some wild blueberries here that I've got ready. Now, friends, those of you who have been following me the past few months, you'll know that I can't have cold foods. Even touching cold things, it kills me. Um, Philip, Carmel from America, I'll turn it around, is saying, hi, Philip. So if you want to say hello, Carmel. Hi, Carmel, what part of America? Uh, I can't remember which part of America, but Carmel's got some little cockatiels too. She has also. So I'll just turn the camera back. Now, friends, these are the um, the wild blueberries that I've been talking to you about. These are frozen ones. Now, hold on a second. It's all right, Jada, I'm coming. All right, so these are the wild blueberries. I've got them frozen. Right, they come all the way, I think, from Canada or America. Oh, I can't remember now. They are, and you can buy them in every state, I think, of Australia. So if you want to know where I get them from in Victoria or anywhere else, just send me a private message. Jada, you're trying to take over my voice. Just send me a private message. So I'm going to make a nice juice out of this, but I can't have it cold because my... Oh, Philip, Carmel she says she's in o Odenden here. Yep, here. Odenden, MD, between DC and Baltimore. Have you been there? Yep. When did you go there? Hold on, let me turn it around. and You can tell Carmel. East Coast, she said. Tell her when you've been there. Come, tell come. I've been to Washington, Baltimore. I worked in Baltimore um, for a month at, uh, in 206. Up and down from uh, Washington, uh, from uh, New York to Baltimore on the train every morning at 6 a.m. and back at 8, 8 p.m. at night. Can you, do you remember the company it was? Yeah, John, John, Faulkner, uh, John Hopkins Hospital I was doing work at. You never even told me you were even John, John Hopkins. Yeah, I've been working. What, Philip, is it? Telling me everything you've done. I don't even know. Thanks for asking that, Carmel. Well, now I know a bit more about him. He's done so many things. I'm not kidding. So, uh, hang on, I'll turn it around again. So, Philip, uh, uh, what? Philip, is that the elderberry juice? Yes. Can, can I have a look at what you. Can I have a look? You want to show everyone your elderberry juice syrup? So, did you put that in your coffee? No, darling, I washed my cup and had it. Oh, okay. Oh, no, no, I just thought it'd be nice. No, it's like a honey substitute, elderberry syrup. I'm very proud of you having his elderberry syrup. All right, so Carmel says from Connecticut, originally just outside New York City, she is. Okay. Have you been to Connecticut, Philip? Uh, no, I actually haven't been to Connecticut. 
Okay. Yeah, I oh, yes, I have been to Kennedy. Yes, I have. Okay. Do you remember what you were doing there? Oh, I can't remember. Was it work or holiday? Or? Work related. What, what, accounting work? No, it was about radiology. Oh, radiology work. Okay, all right. Okay, there you go, Carmel. Well, thanks for that. You helped me learn something else about my husband. So, yeah. friends, Philip's going to help me. I, 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 I've Hold used on. the train system up and down the East Coast many, many times. Okay, so do you want to make any comments about it compared to ours here? To our train system? Works very well, very, very efficient. Uh, Carmel says something about Stanford. Stanford, yeah, Stanford University. Right, is that where you went, Carmel? Stanford Uni? So, so friends, you can hear that um, Jada is screaming in the background. So, Philip, you can help me take out my nutri bullet. I've got to make my juice. I've got to make our juice with some bananas and stuff. But the nutri bullets, I can't remember now where it is. It's down here somewhere. Now, friends, oh, she said something. Um, Carmel said Amtrak. What's Amtrak? What's Amtrak? That's the train organization. Oh, okay. I see. Okay. Yep. All right. Thanks for that, Philip. Yeah, if you don't mind, just putting all my nutri bullets up there so I can make my juice and get that ready. Now, friends, you know that we had a major rescue yesterday of two cockatiels. The universe and the heavens sent me. We lost two of my beloved cockatiels that I had over 20 years. Um, in April, and I can't discuss the um, the um, what happened because I'm not ready emotion to discuss it. And the universe, after three weeks, two three weeks, has sent us another two cockatiels, so we're going to baptize them with the names Deepa and, and Monty. So I'm just going to take you into the healing room. I won't be a moment, Laurie. I'm just going to take you into the healing room. And I've got see, look, friends. This is I want to show you. I'm just about to open up because it's quite early here. I'm just opening up. Can you help me open up the children here, Philip? If you can open up the blinds first. So we've got the other children that are sleeping here. Okay. The other children who are sleeping here. So um, so we open the blinds for them. So the sun. Good morning, Niffy. Good morning. Love you. Love you. Good morning, Niffy. Good morning. Love you, Niffy. Love you. Good morning. You wanna say hello to everyone? You come out of your house, this is Nymphie's little house, right, on her, on her nice luxury couch. And this is also her little play area here with her favourite. And you can see she's been eating because she's got powder on her beak. You've been eating your food with your spirulina, Nymphie. Right now I've got the other ones here I've got to open up. Here's Musty. Good morning, Musty. You can tell friends have just woken up. You see, they're sitting very calmly. Hello, little Rusty. Good morning, Rusty. Okay, I've got to open them up because they, they need to come to their food and their water here. Good morning. All right, and I've got the beautiful, um, here, I'll just open this one up. I've got little Chicky in here. Little Chicky, poor Chicky's got a major, major trauma. Major, major trauma. Right, okay, I'll tell Philip Carmel because Philip comes and goes with the wind. He's going to go outside to open those beds. Now, I'm just going to show you, friends. The cockatiels that we rescued that Philip went and got for me. It was over four hours on the road. Two cockatiels, okay? So just gonna knock on the door. Always so I don't startle them. Good morning, babies. Good morning. They might be still sleeping. There they are. There they are. In my healing room. Right. Hello, babies. Good morning. That's okay. I won't scare them. I've got a little baby here. Because we got them late last night in the dark. And I've got the other baby there. They're just resting. You can see. That's all right, baby. So I'm just going to let them. Thanks, Carmel. That's why I was offline in April. I'm never going to be the same again. I'm always changing anyway. But I'm just going to let the babies now just relax. I don't want them to get startled because they've had major trauma. Also, these babies. Now, Laurie's here. Laurie, you're having your iron and your zinc. Good girl, Laurie. Good girl. Good morning. Laurie loves the camera. Good, good morning. Now, friends, I've got my neutral bullet here, as you can see, and Philip wouldn't have a clue what I need here for it. Oh, no, he has. He's taken out some stuff. So all you do, right, so this is the best gift you can give anyone, really. It is the best. That's all right, Laurie. That's all right. Mummy's just going to be on the camera. you got some spirulina on your beak there, Laurie. Good girl, beautiful girl. Mummy loves you. You know, Mummy loves you. You know that? <laughs> all right, so this is the neutral bullet here. And all you do is, you get it, right? You get some wild blueberries, right? Put them in. Now, 
Maybe it's better that you don't have it too cold, like me. Because remember I said, friends, that I've discovered the past uh, two months that cold foods put so much weight on me. And instantly in one day, the weight's constantly dropping. Don't look at me now. I know you can't tell I'm wearing my loose clothes. They're getting looser and looser. So you just put the wild blueberry in here. Right, I'm going to put it in here and I'm going to wait for it to not get so cold. See, I've got my wild blueberry. That's okay. And what I'm going to do is, it's okay, Laurie. I'm just going to leave the camera. Laurie, are you okay? That's all right, Laurie. That's okay. I'm just going to leave the camera on Laurie for a moment because she's wondering what's going on here. So I'm just going to try and put it in a position where you can see her. You okay, Laurie? It's all right, Agapimu. It's all right. She's a bit excited. She's wondering what is going on here. So hang on a second, Laurie. Oh, hold on a second, Laurie. Just, just, no, I can't do it. Okay, I can't do it there. I'll just do it there. And I'm just going to get um, my banana from here. You can put anything in it, friends. You can put bananas, you can put oranges, you can put whatever you like in it. I don't care. If you don't like celery juice plain, you can even chuck in some celery. Right, so I, I just got my banana here. Right, and I'm going to work... It's all right, darlings. It's all right. See, friends? It's very hard for me to hold the stick while I'm... You okay there? So I'm just going to turn it around because I cannot do, do, try and show you. So I've got my banana. Right? Sorry, I'm a bit diagonal. But you know my life is all over the place. So I'm just going to get this banana and put it... Laurie, Laurie, you want some banana? I think she wants some banana. Right? So I'm putting the banana in with the berries... Right? Sorry, getting it's cooking. Are you having the banana skin? You like the banana skin? So I'm just going to close this, this other wild blueberry. These wild blueberries are amazing according to medical medium. And I can't put the phone again for the sauce because of the EMFs. So I'm just going to leave it here for a second. Now, Laurie, can you just hang on a second? Right? So wild blueberry, banana, hang on a second. Right, and I'm just looking for the future bullet. So this is the top that goes on top of the neutral bullet, right? See, you've got your neutral bullet and you've got the blades. Now hang on a second, Laurie. So you just put this on top, you just screw it on top. Actually, I've got to put some liquid in it, right? Okay, so let's have a look. Just give me a second. I've got some coconut water here. Right, if you like almond, it's better to put either water or... Um, I've had this for a while open, so I just want to check... It's okay. I think it's okay. Let's have a look what the Jew is. No, it's not okay. It's not okay. That's what happens. These um, waters and whatever, you've got to use them. You've got to use them here. I've got my wild blueberry with my banana. Just hang on a second, friends. I'll get some coconut. Now don't, don't knock it. Don't knock it, Laurie. Don't knock it. <laughs> Laurie's gone. Laurie's gone to my wild blueberry. Now hang on a second, Laurie. She's gone to my wild blueberries. Now, give me a second, Laurie. Just give me a second. So, look at the friend. She's very curious. All birds allowed free are very, very, very curious. And I'm looking for my coconut milk, which I don't have any here at the moment. I've got it in storage. So what I'll do so I don't waste your time is I'm going to get my water. Right? I'm going to get my water. Here, I'll get my water. And I'm going to put the water... D just hold your feathers, Laurie. Mummy's trying to multitask and, and show her friends. Right, so give me a second, friends. So you'll see on this Nutribullet... Do you see this? The max? See, it says max. It's a maximum you can put your liquid, whatever you put. You put your coconut water, almond water or whatever. Right, now normally I like it with coconut because I love the taste of the coconut water. Even though most of it is bloody co is mainly water. And then you close it up nicely... So just hold your feathers. Mummy's trying to multitask. Right, just hold on a second. So let me close it properly, friends. So you just close it properly, and I'll show you right now what I'm going to do. Right, so I've closed it up, you see? Right, so you've got to close it well, and, and I'll show you why you've got to close it well. So this is the neutral bullet. So I'm just, Philip, like, darling, I was waiting for you to. No, not those paper towels. I wanted serviettes. There's no serviettes. All right, okay. So, I've plugged in the neutral bullet, right? Put it in. You make sure this is closed really well. 
Then you can turn that upside down. It's so simple, friends. So simple. Now watch this. Watch this. I'm just going to turn it. Watch this. There you go. And there's the wild blueberry with the banana. I needed some coconut milk too because I didn't have any. There we go. The wild blueberry with the banana. There we go. It's that simple, friends. It's that simple. See? And then you turn that again, you just twist it on the side for on and off. You just twist it. See, you look. Put it on and then you twist it for off, right? So simple. You turn it. This is the best Mother's Day present you can get yourselves, right? And then you do it upside down. And let's see what it looks like. Because Laurie wants to see, Laurie wants some caramel so that Laurie wants some smoothie and she does. Right? Philip, can you hold this for me for a moment while I just do the smoothie? I, I can't I can't hold it and do it just hold it there so make sure you're showing it on the flip here so friends can see here all right so I'm going to open it up so you just show what I'm doing so if you open it up and it's better to do it harder than softer so it doesn't go all over the kitchen you can see that beautiful color there of the wild blueberry isn't it beautiful pity to lose it I'll let it drip everything counts I let it drip and I give it to the birds too so, so I'm just going to get a little container to give it to Laurie. Just give me a second, friends. Just, just show people the wild blueberry there, Philip. Now, Laurie, Laurie, come and have your brekkie. So Laurie's going to have some of her brekkie. So I'm just going to get, if you want to show, I'm just going to get a bit of wild blueberry juice for Laurie. Oh, Laurie. Yummy, yummy. cold for her, you see, friends. So she might find it a bit cold. It's got banana in there too that you like. Come on, and your yummies. And they, they need, I think I might have to put something sweet in there, even though it is sweet. But see, she's playing. Follow her, Philip. She's playing. She's investigating her area. Come on, Laurie. So, friends, I'm just going to let this drip a bit. And it's too cold for me to drink. Philip can have some if you want, but it's way too cold for my stomach because I can't have dampness. I've got to have warm foods. So this is a wild blueberry. Now Laurie's gonna have some. Come on. She normally has it, but she's flying. You're flying, my little Laurie. Come here. Come Mummy loves you. Mummy loves you. She loves you more. She has some wild blueberry. Come on. Have your bottom on. Yum. Nice. Nice. Come on. Love me, Laurie. Come on. Feel the play, I want you to play. Thank you for watching everyone. This is Wild Blueberry for the birds and for us. It's unbelievable. Like I said, you, all you need is a Nutribullet, a juicer. You can just do that too. No fuss, no trouble, no leftovers. All the fruit is left in here. Okay, so I'm just waiting to, just to get a bit more tepid for me because I can't have cold juices. So I'm sorry. She can drink it from here, but she won't drink it from me. You're only <laughs> Thanks everyone for watching. Have a fabulous morning. Have a great day. And I might speak to you again today because I've got a lot to tell you about what's going on in the world. It's unbelievable. I've got some stuff that is happening over in Greece. You won't believe what the government are making the people do. The students that are going back to school on Monday. What kind of tests they're making them do. Anyway, love you all. Bye. Say goodbye, Larry. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. You're -bye. Bye -bye. Got the little finish thing to